Hi everyone, welcome back to this week's video. Uh, Dr. Jeff is on vacation right now, and so instead I'm joined by Dr. Morella. She's one of the chiropractors at our clinic, and today we're going to be talking about scoliosis, which is a sideways curve in the spine. Kind of, well, there's many variations of what it can look like, but there's yeah. one of them. Uh, so the purpose of the video is because we'll often get like scoliosis patients as chiropractors. Um, so part of what we're going to talk about is how we assess for it in clinic and then how you can potentially screen for it yourself at home. Um, so there are two types, there's functional scoliosis and then structural scoliosis. So functional scoliosis you can think of as more of um, like a postural, like more of a postural issue, uh, as in like muscle imbalances, uh, it depends on which uh, side you are dominant. Um, and maybe even like a leg length inequality could contribute to a functional scoliosis. Um, a structural scoliosis is there's actually a change within the spine, um, so it can be caused by many things, but the most common type is idiopathic scoliosis, and it's common in adolescents. Um, so idiopathic means we don't exactly know why it started, um, but there is a genetic component to it. Um, so we're going to go through um, some of the tests that we do in clinic and what we like to look for. So one of the tests that a chiropractor can do on you to test for this is called the Adams test. So they'll have the patient bent forward like this and they're looking at the ribs um, and they're looking for something called rib humping. And so you'll notice that one side of the ribs could appear to be higher than the other. And this would be an indicator of structural scoliosis. The other test that can be done is called the lateral bend test. And usually when you bend side to side, your spine is going like this. But with scoliosis, the spine might not correct itself. So it'll look a little more like that. Because of structural scoliosis. Yes. I hope you learned a thing or two about scoliosis today. Um, if you have any questions about it, feel free to contact us. Everybody can have a different treatment plan because the curve of your scoliosis could be different too. So it's important to come in and get assessed. Big thanks to Dr. Morella for joining us for today's video. Um, Dr. Jeff will be back next week, so you'll see him again. If you have any other questions, you can definitely leave them in the comments or send us an email, and we'll be sure to cover a video on that as well. We always love doing that. But as always here at Gold's Worthy Wellness, we got your back.